Wonderful. Well, you may know this name from online, from uh, CS50 IDE, from Reddit, from Facebook and the like, and allow us to introduce our special guest for today, with whom we thought we'd chat for just a couple of minutes before we start answering questions, CS50 own Kareem Zidane. Hi, everyone. My name is Kareem. Uh, I'm a software engineer working with the CS50 uh, team here. Uh, uh, you, like they've mentioned, you may recognize me from uh, Facebook, from other uh, online communities. And I'm really looking forward to um, this office hours today. Wonderful. Well, so glad you're with us here today, Kareem. We thought we'd ask you a couple of questions yourself before we start taking questions from the audience. Uh, you say you're in USA now, according to your name in Zoom, but that's not where we met you. Would you mind sharing with folks how we met you and how you made your way to Harvard and CS50? Absolutely. So I uh, took CS50X, the edX version of the class, in um, 2014, I think. And then after that, I stayed active uh, on the online communities for a while, trying to answer people's questions, which was so much fun, but also was so much beneficial for me because uh, I, I ended up learning a lot about um, topics that were not necessarily covered in the class, either because they were too advanced or because they were just a different subject altogether. Um, and then, and then I think you, David, reached out to me at some point to host some local office hours in Cairo, uh, which we did a few times. Uh, we had quite a few students joining. That was uh, so much fun. Uh, I was kind of more interested in the um, software development side of things. So I started uh, trying to contribute to uh, some of our projects, some of the CSFT projects back then. Um, and then uh, you guys were very welcoming to me. Um, uh, started uh, maybe giving me more problems to tackle and that was so much <laughs> fun to, uh, to go through. Um, eventually, yeah, eventually I got an offer and uh, I joined you in Cambridge. <laughs> And indeed, Kareem has taken over CS50 software development initiatives, especially CS50 IDE, the tool that many of you might be using right now to work on your problem sets and the like. So Kareem, is this to say that you studied computer science formally in high school or in university? Uh, not quite. I've been into like computers, not necessarily computer science or programming uh, for a very long time. I got my first computer when I think was 11 years old or something. Um, <laughs> And so I, I would uh, always explore things, uh, try to make a static website, that I think at some point using Microsoft front page, if you ever uh, used that before. I haven't heard uh, of that in a long time. <laughs> yeah, I remember actually, uh, I, like I mentioned, I was like 11 years old and I did not know how to save in front page. And I kept my computer running all the time because I was afraid I, I, was afraid I would lose my work. Uh, so that's something fun that I remember. <laughs> Well, and to this day, the IDE runs on your laptop, right? So long as your laptop's online, the IDE is online? <laughs> kind of, yes. <laughs> uh, um, yeah, so I then uh, started learning a little bit about uh, some graphic design tools like Adobe Photoshop, Illustrator, InDesign, all that stuff. And I actually, I, I, wouldn't, I wasn't professional, uh, so to speak. Uh, I was just curious about these things and I knew how to uh, do a couple of things and I made a couple of things that made sense to me and I ended up getting a job in, in a company uh, as a software designer for some time. But then I realized that's not really, like I, I can't go so much more forward with this. Um, I, I'm actually more interested in other stuff. Uh, mm. and so I, I started exploring more and that's when I found some uh, programming classes, um, including CS50. Uh, on edX and then I started taking a class and it literally changed my life. <laughs> well, you've done an extraordinary job since joining CS50's team formally and indeed it really all started uh, by Kareem popping up and answering questions in CS50's Facebook group years ago. So thank you certainly for everything you've done and continue to do for CS50. Absolutely, yeah. Thank you so much for the chance and uh, for the amazing communities that we have.